what up it's your boy nwp but you can call me pwn and uh before we get started with today's video i am doing a 2500 v buck giveaway and if you'd like to figure out how to enter the giveaway go ahead and stay tuned in this video and we'll talk about it a little bit later on but in my last video i had done my first solo victory here in fortnite so today why don't we step it up a notch and go with a solo 15 kill victory now i know it's not the most kills you've heard of no it's not the most kills you've seen but keep in mind i've been playing for one week total. that is my general key basis here is that i've been only playing for a week and i got a 15 kill solo victory under my belt by now so yeah how about that but listen this game is a lot of fun. I've been having a lot of fun learning the little meta that's in the game, per se, where you, you know, build up, build around, defend yourself with, you know, structures, basically. And I've been really liking this uh, kind of meta, but <clears throat> it's time for me to revert back to being the run-and-gun monster that I really am and what I like to do and how I like to do things. Now, the building should just be a tactical advantage to me because I'm a tactical, you know, person to begin with. So I like to move and use things to my advantage always and be in a different spot. Even if, you know, it's not really to my advantage, I want to be somewhere else rather than where I'm expected to be. So with this guy, I like, he was out in the lake and I knew where he was trying to get out of the water. So obviously this is the spot right here. And I'm going to hit the PlayStation beanie kind of stuck out clear as day. So he got it right in his head with a little knock on wood there. But let's be serious, guys. This game is a lot of weird gun battles, per se. And it takes the verticality or 3D movement to a different area than, say, your Call of Duty Advanced Warfare, Black Ops 3, or Infinite Warfare, uh, Halo, Titanfall. This completely changes the game of verticality by giving you the ability to make structures. Now, being that it is the Unreal Engine, it does concern me that at some point or some time in the future, they will try and add in um, the duck and cover system like in Gears of War uh, and a lot of other games that Epic is known for. And uh, that could be a concern to me for a, a number of reasons. But in my humblest of opinions, this you know current setup is actually pretty good. So, yeah. Now, um, I, I don't know, man. Like, there's some weird talk about the meteor in the sky taking out tilted towers. Will tilted towers fall? I don't know. It could be really cool. I like the concept of taking a game and instead of adding DLC maps throughout the life cycle of the game, you deform the current terrains so that the maps become something new slowly rather than just saying like here's a bunch of new stuff learn it all again you know changing things moderately here and there uh in terms of world gives people a chance to learn it and you know still remember some of the areas basically slowly learning new stuff and uh yeah look at this play right here just to just to cut that conversation short real quick and interrupt it look at this play right here i interrupt my second band-aid Still get the second band-aid off after taking a couple steps. Don't know what I was thinking to be honest with you, but watch this gunplay. And this is why switching to your shotgun that late is probably not the greatest idea anymore. A little dance on your grave like Barishnikov. I'll piss you off. Alright. Now we finally got some stuff together here. I had to fall out of the sky to get some stuff, but whatever. We got them some more materials. We're doing alright, right? But yeah, anyways, like I was saying, the whole <clears throat> verticality system and the way that this game plays is a lot of fun and very like differently thought out and because it's epic you know they got a lot of people just willing to try the game uh in general rather than not and uh you know the so you know verticality 3d movement whatever you want to call it it's basically a good way to do jetpacking without jetpacking and i like it so yeah um I don't know, like, this is a weird closing where this went, too. I'm not going to lie. Like, this is just, I, I've not played it too many times. I think it's maybe twice so far in the last week I've played here. Like, where it closes out here. And, uh, I don't know. It's a little awkward. As a matter of fact, I think I have a loss over here in, like, nearly the same exact spot I'm in in, like, second place from that, uh, from trying to use that stupid rocket launcher and being in remote control mode. Um, 
yeah i don't know how i feel about that thing i feel like it could be really cool but it is so slow that it seems more like a surfing tool than anything else um you know but i played the hell out of this kid here all right so this kid right here i don't know what he was thinking but he just got his head blown right off like that was just outrageous and uh yeah so let's get into talking about this giveaway okay so i have a 2500 v-buck giveaway i'm gonna do it when i have a thousand subscribers now if you want to be entered in the giveaway i have a link in the description with a couple of steps for you to follow and you will be entered now if you enjoy if you don't enjoy this you don't want to subscribe you don't have to it's not something like that but if you want to enter the giveaway you got to stay subscribed to the channel and be subscribed to the channel if you've done that step and uh you know then you're entered but there's a few other things like liking videos stuff like that now continuously add videos to like for more entries until we've hit that mark but basically i'm in a push to try and hit the monetization point for youtube and i can't do it without your help so i'm going to give back to the community as much as i possibly can and uh, with that being said uh, you can watch me here do some nonsense to get out of the storm Look at my health right now, guys. Look at look at my health. Look at my health. No shields, no health, okay? Like, just barely got out of the storm here. This is the, this was, I told you, this was an action-packed, outrageous, ridiculous game. The way everything went down in it was just absurd. From the beginning to the end, I was literally fighting people to get out of the, you know, the storm area and into safe zone. And meanwhile, there's a dude standing on top of me right now, running around on top of me, okay? And I'm just like, okay, how am I going to, like, what am I going to do here? So I said, to hell with it, and this is how I played this off. Watch this, okay?